Hey guys, what's up? So today we're showing top best jerry cheese, 5 is 11, 12, 13, and 14. The first tweet is called Sens Button, Buttons for Sens Navbar. Um, so as useful buttons to the navigation bar on the Sens app. It's compatible with iOS 13 and 14. Gives a useful way of toggling dark mode, safe mode, or respring straight from settings with a clean look. This tweet is actually a theme called GC, and that's what it looks like. This tweet is called uh, Tweak, or it was a theme called Vintage uh, Keyboard Pack and latest keyboard themes pack so the complete latest uh, keyboard pack contains three mods and these are the supported devices all knobs devices support languages this tree is called milky way 3 uh it's the most advanced tweak for multitasking so you can multi -win window mode resizing each windows minimizing windows then this tweak is called libnebs and it's a collection of custom preference related classes using most of uh, tweets the official replacement for Liv Tyler Dev. This tweet is called Genesis 2, the evolution of something beautiful. So adds a large variety of ways to customize device while also enhancing the jailbroken experience. It's made for people who are tired of waiting for Apple to give us the true freedom on our devices. This tweet is called Tooth and basically uh, smarter Bluetooth connection management via activator. This tree is called Tooth Module, and quickly connect, disconnect from Bluetooth devices using your control center uh, configure devices and settings. This tree is called A Blaze, <clears throat> and colorful animated music backgrounds. And this tree is actually called, or well, I have gameplay, but it's actually called Game Pigeon Hats. It's um, basically the best Game Pigeon tweak, so it's kind of an alternative to Bird Poop. This tree is called Campy, clear ESIF, make GIFs, import photos, and more. So, pretty cool. This tree is called Linux and device ultimate device customization for iOS 12 and 13. So you have all these features right here. The next week is called Folded, uh, Folded Folders Your Way. So, more options, new features, as over um, as over features to allow you to customize your photos as much as you can imagine. See so all these features to customize your uh, folders. This week is called TF. Did that say? And basically, uh, see those pesky deleted comments without um, posts and posts without leaving Reddit. This week is called Alternate Controls Two. Is also um, Alternate Controls Three. And offers a set of on-screen software controls for iOS. You have these features right here. This is called Fake GPS. It allows you to change your location, um, you know, on your device as you wish. This week is called Skinny Settings, and gives you minimal, useful, and smooth options to make better and more functional your settings application. Adding these nice features. This tree is called Ac uh, uh, Demo. Compatible with 64-bit devices, with this tweet you can control the speed of a quite of quite a few games. So provide three modules for different games. So pretty cool. This tree is called UC Step, and customize health data. This tree is called Music Bots, floating music controls. This tree is called Jarvis. Power multi center. <clears throat> so it places notification center and control center in one place for easy access and much more. This tree is called Circolizer and basically brings a unique music visualizer experience to lock screen and notification center on iOS 12 and 13. So these features right here. This tweak is called Custom SW, also mobile substrate tweak. So, um, customize switcher any way you want. Simple tweet to add many changes to the switcher. Call apps one swipe down, change cards, custom size, change the title color for, sw for switcher, grid switcher with custom size, double grid switcher for this iOS 12 and soon be iOS 13. High, um, show high status bar and switcher, animation, high title, high icon, remove background blur. So, pretty cool. This is called eKip and improves the connection between your Mac and iOS. So you could basically have like your iOS on your, I think your Mac, and you control your phone from like your Mac. This tweet is called Status Bar Mitts uh, from the Twitch repository. Colorize your status bar um, icons any color you want. This tweet is called KB Color. Changes your keyboard and badge color. This tweet is called Quart. 
notifications redefined. So it brings a new look to your lock screen. You have notification banners, um, media player, pull dismiss, customization, and tweet support, and return policy. You guys can read about that. The next tweak is called Bordy, and <clears throat> basically it's long gone on the days uh, where using Discord bot was the only way to send data from iPhone to PC. This tweak uh, allows you to, the tweet allows you to seamlessly sync your clipboard with your PC. You can sync text between PC and the iPhone, copy an image from the iPhone to the PC. This tweet is just a theme called iOS Big Sur, a uh, theme inspired by Mac OS Big Sur. So, that's how it looks. This tweet is called Watermelon Watch OS Style Lock Screen Widgets. This theme is called 3D World. Um, so, you can see that's what it looks like. It's like 3D. This tweet is called Can't Reach Me, Custom Actions for the Reachability Jester. This tweet is called YouTube Light. And basically, it's like a YouTube, uh, you have all these features right here for YouTube. It's like a YouTube Plus Plus alternative. This tweet is called Color My Battery, um, Cloud iOS 11 13, show all devices. It colors your battery based on your preferences for the desired battery percentage level. And the last tweak is called VK again. And basically, with this tweak, uh, here we go again. So, you guys, thank you so much for watching. Catch you next one. Like, comment, subscribe, and peace.